hey guys welcome back to my channel so today i have a really random video um i just decided to do this video because i did finish my february playlist for my spotify the link is down below but before i wanted to share that since february just started i might upload that probably next week or so i'm not sure yet but I decided to still go on the musical realm and show you some of my favorite vinyls or records, whatever you would call it. As you can see, my record player is right behind me. I have a Crosley, I believe it's a Cruiser record player. I got it for Christmas about four years ago, which is crazy now because I haven't used it for quite a while, but I've just been getting back into it. So I decided why not show you guys all the vinyls that I have, which isn't exactly a lot. It's still growing, but... I'll just show you what I have so far and then maybe later on I'll actually have a bit more that I can share with you guys. So if you guys want to see my vinyl collection and you're interested, just keep on watching. So the first vinyl I have, I actually got it recently and I got this from Shran Bookstore in NYC near Union Square. If you guys are from New York, then you know where that is um, or you should know where that is. but. This album I like a lot. I used to listen to one main song on here since like, I think it was like ninth grade. No, it was later than that. It was probably like 11th grade or something. And I used to be obsessed with that song. But this is the Strokes Angles album. I did show this in a January haul. If you guys didn't see that, check it out. But I like this album so much. The Strokes are amazing. Um, I think one Governor's Ball that I went to festival uh, they were actually performing and unfortunately I didn't see them and I kind of wish I did now because I'm enjoying this vinyl so much. It's so awesome and yeah, you guys should definitely check it out. I believe this was about, I'll say 24, which is a bit expensive. No, I think this was like 18, which was a bit okay, but you know, it's a good album so I don't mind it. The next vinyl is one of my favorite, favorite bands, and it is The White Stripes. And this is the Get Behind Me Satan vinyl. I also show this in my January favorites. This is also new as well. I believe it was around 24, which was a little bit expensive, but I do like The White Stripes. I love this album so much. Some of my favorite songs from it is Blue Orchid, My Doorbell, Denial Twist, Take, 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 like this album is so great this vinyl looks amazing i just love like how it looks inside it's so awesome and even the back with jack white on the back and these little pictures but this is a really great vinyl i really really like it i'm kind of happy that i did spend the 23 dollars on it and i hope to get some more white stripe vinyl soon but this i also bought from strand bookstore if i didn't say that already the next one I also shared in a January haul. I'm just showing all my vinyls, so you might see some repeats from that video. And this is the original motion picture soundtrack for To Sir With Love featuring Sydney Poitier. I mainly got this for a more nostalgic feel because my mom loves this movie and growing up I feel like she would watch it randomly and I fell in love with the song To Sir With Love. It just brings back like, you know, the nostalgia of like watching that movie, so... I decided to get this. It's only eight bucks from a record store called Good Records NYC, also near Union Square, a little bit lower. I think it's like on Fifth Avenue or Fifth Street. I'm not sure, but I'm definitely going to leave those stores in the down bar if you guys want to check them out if you are in the New York area or if you're coming to New York anytime soon and you want to get some vinyls. Um, but this was only eight bucks and I'm so happy that I found it. Like, I think that's such a great deal and I had to pick it up. The next is also a beloved record and group and I love them so much and this is my Daft Punk Discovery album. This is so amazing. I love it too much. It's just a classic. Um, this one actually features One More Time, Harder, Better, Faster, Stronger, Verdice Quo, Too Long. Like this is a throwback. I love it. I definitely want to get another Daft Punk um, vinyl. I did see one but I don't want to buy it this time. But I think I'm going to go back and get it. But yeah, this is so amazing. I just love the inside of it. Like, look at that. That looks great. That's like light beans and everything. Um, this, I believe, was also in the 20s range, which was a little bit expensive for me. But what can I say? It's Daft Punk, of course. They're huge, so I don't mind paying for it. 
the next one, which is a band that is currently going back on tour, that I would really like to see at the Firefly Festival, but I don't want to go there because I think it's like a camping one and I'm not used to that. But this is the Arctic Monkeys AM vinyl. And this was their last album to come out. I'm hoping that they're coming out with more music. But this was an amazing album. I love this so much. It was very different from their usual like sound, but I don't know. I really enjoyed it. This has Do I Want to Know, Are You Mine, um, Why Do You Only Call Me When You High, I Want to Be Yours. Those are my top favorites on this. I used to listen to this all the time. This reminds me of like three years ago. I used to rock this, but I'm so happy I got this. I did get it from Christmas, so I don't know how much it was, but I'm so happy that I got this with the record player. It's amazing. The next one is such a classic, especially for my culture and my family because I'm from the Caribbean, if no one knew. Um, Central America, I still consider that Caribbean because I'm from Belize, the only non-Spanish speaking country in Central America or South America. So, fun fact. But there, we mainly listen to reggae music. And of course I had to get the Bob Marley vinyl. <laughs> This I also got with my record player for Christmas, and this is The Legend, The Best Off, Bob Marley. This features Is This Love, I love that song, um, No Woman, No Cry, Could You Be Love, Three Little Birds, Buffalo Soldier, Get Up, Stand Up, Stir It Up, One Love, I Shot the Sheriff, Redemption Song, all the great songs from Bob Marley, and I love Bob Marley so much, his music is so so soothing sometimes like it's not even like reggae music where you just want to dance but I love this vinyl it's definitely a classic and I will cherish it forever and ever and ever my next one is one that I know almost every single song on it but it's a throwback also for me not super throwback but like my high school years throwback and this is the Miguel Kaleidoscope Dream vinyl I also got this from my record player and, or Christmas, I got my record player for my cousin, but for Christmas for my family, I got vinyls because they knew I was getting it, possibly. But this one features Adorn, Don't Look Back, Use Me, Do You, The Thrill, How Many Drinks, The P Is Mine. I know that's a lot of people's favorite song, but I'm not gonna lie, it's a good song, but it's a little bit, you can't really listen to it out loud because, yeah, it's talking about the things, but. I do really like this album. It was so, so good. I feel like I need to bump it again because I haven't listened to songs from this album in so long. Just like his new album that came out. But I love this album. I don't know how much it was. If I could still find them, I'll just leave them in the link down below. Probably from Amazon. The next one, I used to rock this album 2014 January, which is when it came out. And that's all it reminds me of because I love that time in my life. This is a 2014 Forest Hill Drive vinyl from j cole i love this a lot it's so great i love his music is he my favorite rapper i don't know i don't think so but <laughs> it was definitely a great time in my life when this came out and i'm so happy that i bought it this is how the back looks it's so freaking good it just brings back memories another nostalgic feel to me and yeah i think it's like around 16 dollars, which wasn't too bad so I love this album, it's great. The next one is a band that I used to listen to all the time. I think my sister actually put me onto them and I saw them in concert at Radio City Music Hall for one of my sister's birthday. And this is Bastille. I'm sure you guys know a song that they came out with. I think it was not Pompeii, but it was a famous song that came out. I don't know what it is, but I'll probably put it on the screen right here. But this is the Bad Blood album and I like this a lot. It's a very poppy, but not too pop sort of feel, like more like electronic sort of like, I don't know. You just have to listen to it. But yeah, I do like this album. I also got it for Christmas and I enjoy it a lot, but it's great. Check it out. I'm going to leave them in the Spotify link too. The next one I saw at Governor's Ball and it was a little bit crazy with the audience. All the girls loved them at that moment. But this is the 1975 album. Which one is this? I think it's just the 1975. I'm not sure. But this was like a hit at the moment. But yeah, I don't know. Everyone loved Matty right there. Um, they are an English band group. I think it's a band. But 
yeah, I love this album. It's really nice, like, rock, but, like, soft, like, pop feel. I don't know. I guess you in your feels. My favorite songs are The City, Money, uh, Hard Out, Girls, Robbers, Settle Down, and She Way Out. Those are my favorite ones right there. But this, I believe, I also got this for Christmas. So I'm not sure how much it was, but it will be in the bottom description bar. This is another classic. It doesn't look like the other ones. It's just in this plastic thing. But this is the Michael Jackson 25 Greatest Hits, I guess, album. Or vinyl, I should say. I also got this for Christmas. I love Michael Jackson. I cried when he died. He's so close to my heart. Big part of my life growing up. And... Yeah, it's just so amazing. I'm happy I got this. This one features Want to Be Starting Something, Baby Be Mine, The Girl Is Mine, Thriller, Beat It, Billie Jean, Human Nature, PYT, and The Lady of My Life. I love this album. It's so good. And whenever I need a little bit retro feel and throwback, I'll pop this on. And my last favorite vinyl thus far would have to be from my favorite rapper, not J. Cole, it used to be J. Cole at the time but this was also my favorite rapper but now this is just my main favorite rapper and that's that but this is the kid cuddy the man on the moon vinyl i cannot tell you how much i love kid cuddy i need the other man on the moon too because that album's even greater and i need to buy it like today or tomorrow or something but i love kid cuddy so many people know that he is like my number one like man crush in the celebrity world I was obsessed with him since like ninth grade. Yes, I have a huge crush on Kid Cudi. If anyone looks like Kid Cudi out there, hit me up because I don't mind going on a date with you. But anyways, this one features In My Dreams, Soundtrack to My Life, which is a very nostalgic song for me. Um, Day and Night, Sky Might Fall, Make Her Say, Pursuit of Happiness. A bunch of great songs and a bunch of great vibes and you need to buy this record because it's so so good I love it I will never get rid of it and if I ever lose it I'll be really really sad because this is my husband right here and I need him in my life I need him but yeah I got this for Christmas also so I don't know how much it is it looks amazing inside it has a lot of stuff about each song I think I don't know it's very small wording but yeah i love this it's really great so guys that is my entire vinyl collection i know it's kind of small but the amount of money i spent on it isn't that small but anyways i know it will keep on growing and if i do get any more vinyls i will be sure to share them with you guys i hope you guys enjoyed this video if you did please give it a huge thumbs up and please hit that subscribe button that little red button right there because i would really appreciate it or is it over here I don't know either side it would really help me out so 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 much um i hope you guys enjoyed this video thank you for always watching and i will see you guys in the next one bye